Right, I've rigged the battery, put the control books together, and the wheel is now on the back. As you can see, it's a rear wheel with a a sprocket, so you can't it can't be put the wrong way round. Okay. There's the instructions, been through it. There's the control box, we're going to come down for a second. The throttle control, I haven't got anything powered up yet, I'm going to show you all the connections. Right. The control box itself is... Ignore the fact I've bent it, that's how it fits into the connector. But as you can see, it's the correct one for this, you can speak Japanese. Yeah. Okay, right. First I'm going to show you the, the battery. The battery itself... Oops, sorry. The battery itself... Did I show you that properly? I was going to show you. Yeah, I did, didn't I? Upside down, can't read it anyway. Okay, terminals come through here. That comes through to the back of the control box, comes through here, through a fuse to a. Uh, that's because he ain't got it on the cabinet, he's going to have a box on the back here and it's going to be fitted inside. But I mean, so the cable comes through there, it comes around, and it comes to the battery. The battery's switched off at the moment. I'm going to switch it on because all everything else is powered off. Clicking the back, that's the power key, right on the You can show you the power, how much we got in it. Press this, ignoring my mucky fingers. He says, so you can see it's full power. Okay, we're on full power. I'm going to turn it off for a second while I explain the rest of it. Okay, we've got a cable here. Comes from the connect, from the control box, back into the control box. That can change it from a 250 to a 1500 I don't know what setting we're going to know. this is irrelevant we've got two more loose end cables here one's for the pedal assist and the other one is I have no idea I think it's for an LED connector when you get when you fit one into it but them two are not needed so we're going to put them around there see the, the one is a cable for a pedal assist and one's Anyway, so we'll lose them and keep losing the frame, but we don't need those and we don't need that. It's got two settings. On his bike, he's got um, a switch, which is what up here. That connects up to that, so it turns it from one to the other, so he can change off road and on road. We have two, three cables here now. As you can see, this is the main one green, yellow, blue green, yellow, blue. So that's wired up correctly. Yeah, look and see. I think one of those, that's for the electronics which we don't have. It's pins, so we can't do much with that. So they're out of the way. They're, that's irrelevant. So this is the working bit we need. This one, as you can see, comes from the control box. Through here. It's a bit confusing. I'm going to come back to this bit in a minute. As you can see, don't you see the colours? But they don't match. But we'll ignore that for a minute. Come through here. Look at that. And look, it's up to the throttle grip. Right. The other wiring here. It also goes to the axle, which is, I assume, is the control systems. We have on the back side coming from the um, coming from the, the axle. You see the wiring, black black red top, yellow green blue at the bottom. I should have connected that in the same way so you can make sure it's all so it all looks right. This side underneath, yellow green and blue, as you see it matches up. I think you can keep your focus, and on the top end the red. Okay, so that's all wired up correctly. These colours don't match. Don't understand why. We got yellow, yellow, blue, white, green, bl red, black. We got two orange. Kind of red, red with black. A green and yellow. Well, it should be yellow with green tracer, a red with black, a white tracer, and a black. Confusing, but we'll leave it there. Right, okay. Turn the power on. 
and check the power on here yes we have full power so we've got full power on there so everything should be ready to run we'll double check move the work the hand yeah that's free playing I'm on my own here so we're not going to be cheating I'm going to now show you the throttle with it on the control I'm going to show you working you can see how I'm touching it very gently it's not screwed in, ha 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 ha, never mind. We'll turn it round, to, uh, to, you know, no, I'll turn it round until it catches. It's not going to catch. Oh! But you see what happened. Now you're going to say I'm doing that by hand. So I'm going to take this off, that's why it was off. And I'm going to show you. Okay, stand up. I've got it. I've got it here in my hand. I'm going to take it. Up. Come up here. See, it's connected. Connected. I'm going to stand right back here. I'm sure. I know what's going to happen. So I'm going to show. Put it forward, I'm going to show you again, so you can see there's no one at the back there cheating. I'm going to tear, turn the power off, which is here. Put it back in. It's not tightened up, there's a screw tightened up, as you can see. I'll check the battery again just to show that the battery's not anything wrong with the battery. He says, there it is, full power. Just continue shot, remember, and here is the bike. The gearing wants fixed in, and I don't get it on at the moment because there's no point. The wheel is running backwards. Show the control again. Like I say, I banged that because it, it didn't fit in the slot right.